And we are rolling. Good. Well, hello there, YouTube fans. This is Fuchsia and and Smokey. And we're going to be learning how to make a certain kind of craft. I wonder what it could be. Let's find out. Roll film! Smarty Birds. Well, hello there. Oh, hey, Gary. Are you ready for a fun science experiment? Yes! Today we're going to be making a paper mache volcano <gasps> that actually erupts. Ooh, science! <laughs> Take notes, Smokey. Oh, actually, I'll take the notes. Okay, here we go. You'll need a one liter bottle, three cups of water, and we're gonna need a lot of paint. You can use any colors, but we'll be using gray, light blue, white, dark blue, and purple to mimic Eagle Island. Next, we'll need one cup of flour, four tablespoons of baking soda, one tablespoon of dish soap, two cups of vinegar, a funnel, a pitcher, red and yellow food coloring, a paintbrush, and a cutting tool such as scissors or a utility knife. Dang! I hope you're taking notes. I am. And you'll also need a large piece of cardboard, <sighs> masking tape, a whole lot of newspaper, and a mixing bowl. Jeez! Don't forget your measuring cups. <laughs> Oh yeah, I forgot about that. We're gonna be using a cup and a tablespoon today. Make sure to have a grown-up ready to help if you get stuck. We need to work together. If I'm moving too fast, <laughs> you can always stop and rewind. Might want to pause now and go get the stuff if you <sighs> haven't already. Right now, I'm just writing all it down. How are you writing it yep, so fast? I have telekinesis. It. Oh, right. Ready? Okay, okay, now I'm done. Here we go. Whew. First, lay down some cardboard. If you want your volcano to look like Zeta's, you'll need to fold your newspaper like this to create a wedge for the bottle to rest on. Right. Then, stick the wedge to the cardboard with your masking tape. Next, position your one liter bottle on the wedge and secure it with tape. Then, hmm. crumple some of the newspaper into balls about the size of your fist. Got it. Arrange them around the bottle, building it up to form the base of your icy mountain. <laughs> Ooh. I'm getting cold. I still here. feel bad for the dog. Then, Use masking tape to keep those newspaper balls in place. Oh. Don't want them getting away. Now it's time to create your paper mache paste. Ooh. Pour in your flour and water. Mix it up with your hands to get all those little clumps out. Got it. Then, rip and dip a strip of newspaper into the mixture. Lightly slide your finger down the strip to get rid of any extra paste. Ooh. Slimy. Ooh. Then, apply the strip to your volcano. Repeat this process as many times as necessary, working your way around the base. Hmm. Once you've covered the whole structure, feel free to go back and add extra strips. The more layers you have, the easier it'll be to decorate. Hmm. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm tired. Let's take a break and let this dry overnight. I'm gonna let my head rest In the morning, and write with my you hands can have this a time. Help you Good. Cut up excess cardboard with your cutting tool. Now that it's all dry, what do you say we add some color? Oh Add yeah. Brush and some white paint to give yourself a nice clean slate to work on. You may need several coats to cover it completely. Yep. Once the more you cover it with white dry, paint, the more the colors create. will stand out. Use the rest of your paint to decorate your volcano. You can make it like the movie or do your own thing. We're making it like the movie. Now it's time for the explosively fun part. Oh. <gasps> oh, I love this part. Surface. <gasps> Mix your last cup of water, baking soda, and dish soap, and add some food coloring to get your perfect lava color. Ooh. Place the funnel into the top of your volcano, <gasps> then pour the baking soda mixture inside. Phew. Now take a deep breath. Here we go. It's, time. it's the I big moment. Oh. <laughs> take your cup of vinegar and pour it into the volcano. <gasps> Okay, that was a bit funny. Oh boy, I, for one, cannot wait to get to work on this. Me neither. I'm usually a builder, but this looks exciting. Well, I guess we better get to work on it then. Do you remember all the stuff we need? 
Well, yeah, I told you I have it written down. Oh, good. Well, folks, looks like we're going to be signing off. This is Smokey and Fuchsia. And we are out.